We couldn't get it played on English radio at all. They told us it was too slow. So a young promotion man said, let's try and get a piece of the film and made a promo film. And then I went on television and suddenly the phone went to a friend of mine. He said, congratulations, you sold 60,000 records today. It was after just one or two clips on television. Is it a kind of dream? Floating out of the time Following the river of death downstream Oh, is it a dream? There's a fog along the I really wanted to write the symphonic score for Watership Down, but I think they had me in the bracket as being a songwriter. And the director, his name was John Hubley, he said, I would like you to write a song about death. And I thought, wow, that is a terrible thing to be asked to write. How can I write about death without being too morbid? Yeah. And uh, I went home and I thought for a couple of days and I thought, well, actually, Death is the thing we all, it's the biggest question in all of our minds. And it's the biggest mystery of all. What happens after you die? Bright eyes, burning like fire. Bright eyes, how can you close and fail? How can the light? When I did Bright Eyes, they said to me, who would you like to sing it? And I said, well, I've got a list of 10 people, and at the top of it is Art Garfunkel. But I, I said, I know you won't get Art Garfunkel. They said, no, we'll try. And they sent him my demo, and within 24 hours, he said, yes, we'll do it. And within a week, he was in my house learning the song before we recorded it the next day. There's a fog along the A strange glow in the sky And nobody seems to know where it goes And what does it mean? Oh, is it a dream? And it was very sad because John Hubley, the director, he came to the session with Mark Garfunkel, he was there for it, he loved it. And then he went on to have heart surgery, and uh, he died very shortly after the session. So uh, it's it, kind of right that he asked you to write a song about death, and then died during the process. Yeah, it made me think. Well, I, now I know why he asked me to write that song. Is it a kind of Hazel is the leader of the rabbits, and they think he's been killed. And there's one rabbit who has kind of visions, and he thinks, no, I don't think Hazel's dead. And that's the point. At the point where they think he's died, that they go off into this dream about what happens when you die. The idea of the eyes, when someone dies, the brightness goes away from their eyes. And I didn't really find that out until my own father died many years later. How can the light that burns so brightly burn so pale? And I realized, whoa, this is exactly bright eyes because there's no light there anymore.
How can the light that burns so brightly suddenly burn so pale? It's about dying. Thank you.